Hey everybody, this is David Barnyard Bees. Uh, today's video is about another queen situation. And the last video I did, it showed a queen being accepted and how they acted when they accepted her. Well, here's the, the opposite side of the spectrum, what happens. Can you see this right here? This little ball that they got going on right here. And you'll see the queen. They're balling this queen. <clears throat> this was actually the swarm. If you remember my my last video when I had the swarm in the air and I used the stick and the pole with a frame on it to get it down and then I come over and I watched the swarm come in. Well, when I come down here yesterday and I was checking, they was balling the queen and they had her balled up in the bottom of the hive. Well, I rescued her, saved her, and put her in one of these cages here, one of these little plastic cages. Well, I put her in the cage, put her back in the hive for a couple of days, and I plugged it up with wax where they couldn't get it out. Well, they, they got it out. But as you can see right here, there's absolutely no mistaking what this looks like. These bees are angry. They absolutely hate this queen. There's something about her they don't like. And a little while ago, I made, I already made one video, but my camera shut off right in the middle of it, so I had to restart it. So, she actually has flown away and then flew back a couple times. She don't want to leave, but they're gonna kill her. So, the only thing we can do is put her back in the cage. Put her right there so I can... Uh, they're actually... See, that's a tight. See how tight that is. They're not interested in stinging me. They're, they're only wanting to kill her. That's only, the only thing they got in mind. So, what I'm going to have to do is separate her From these bees. I've got to put it on pause so I can put her in a cage and then I'll return. Okay. I finally got her back in the cage. They did not want to let her go. They had a death grip on her. She's one of our mark queens. So that swarm, when we did a split, they apparently, they, they swarmed out and ended up in this box as you've seen on, on one of my videos now i've been through this hive and i've been through it two or three times i've not yet found a queen i've not yet seen eggs where another queen's laying but something about that queen they absolutely hate so what i'll have to do is try to introduce another queen to this colony because they will kill her absolutely no question about it and this is a I mean, it's not a very big swarm, but it's not a tiny swarm either. There's, there's a decent size amount of bees in it. But they almost look like it had something bald there. But I've looked all through it and I've not yet seen a queen not saying there isn't one. It's possible. But what I'll do, I'll close this hive back up. And then I'll come back. tomorrow and and I'll put another queen in there and a lot of times you do that and they're fine with them sometimes they'll never accept another queen that that is possible too and uh, sometimes uh, hives are just doomed to die if they won't ever accept a queen it's it doesn't it's rare they just didn't like her and, and I mean there's a 90% chance when I put a, a queen in here tomorrow that they'll accept her more than likely and then there's a real good chance we don't want to take this queen and try to put it in another colony. There's a good chance they'll accept her. Um, it, it, it's hard to tell sometimes why they do that. She flies well. She's not wounded for sure. Um, so I, I'm not really sure. They just there's something about her. It, you can't explain it sometimes why they don't like it. That's just bees and their how they act. 
but I thought that was very important. I want a new bee beekeeper to see that. And if you hadn't seen my other video on the release and I made a queen, it was like two videos back. Go back and watch it and watch how gentle and nice they was to that queen. They uh, they had no problem whatsoever with, with that queen. So you just never know. So what I'll, I'll install another queen tomorrow and I'll take this one and put her in another colony. And that's all for today. I just wanted to show that. I thought that was really interesting. And, um, well, I see it all the time. It's nothing new. It's just I want people to see that, to see what the difference is between them tending to the queen. You know, the, the queen that they accept, uh, they'll feed her, they'll uh, tend to her. But this, they had her bought up, and she was good as dead. So that's it for today, and please like and subscribe. Yes, we still have queens. Uh, we'll have queens all the way through, at least through September. And we're, we're taking deposits on our uh, 2018 packages, three pound packages, and in our, uh, our five frame nukes. Uh, go to barnyardbees.com and you can put down your deposit for your 2018. We ship packages. We do not ship nukes. We ship queens and packages only. Uh, so if, if any in, anybody interested in our packages, our packages are, are really gentle, really nice stock of bees. And we can, we'll ship them anywhere in the country except Alaska and Hawaii. Just uh, go to barnyardbees.com and put down your deposit. And please like and subscribe. And I'll put the number down below for our store manager Heather if you're interested in any of our barnyard bees high top feeders uh, Queens nukes packages um, we got a video on our store anything you see in our store you're interested in call them we'll we'll get that shipped right out to you and please like and subscribe and thanks for watching barnyard bees